number one vasectomy expert in the universe is here. And we're going to get you ready for your big day, your big V-day, the day of your vasectomy. And I got my vasectomy in May 2022, so I've done all this research and I got all the answers. So first of all, you need to have done enough research and all the different um, birth control types that you're confident that vasectomy is the best one for you. And you're confident that you know enough from doing your research in the vasectomy that your interviews with the urologist were successful. So first of all, get your research. That's been completed. Second one, okay, you've chosen your urologist. I recommend interviewing three to four. You know, they're going to cost you 150 to 200 bucks to interview them, most of them. Um, and you want to do that because, I mean, whatever, 200 500 bucks, whatever, to have you in good health the rest of your life and make sure this vasectomy doesn't get, get screwed up, definitely worth it. All right, so you completed those and you've chosen the urologist you're good to go with. Next thing you need to do, make sure you have your tight underwear. Basically, like the sports underwear uh, with a cup is buy that super tight. Just throw the cup out. You don't need it. And then also make sure you've got either bags of ice or frozen peas and then Tylenol. So bags of ice or frozen peas, that's if uh, it's a little bit too painful after the operation. I didn't need any of those. And the Tylenol is because ibuprofen will limit the inflammation after the procedure when we actually want the inflammation after the procedure to help with healing. And if you ask your doc, they'll tell you the same thing. Um, next is you need to know how you're getting back home. So they will not let you drive home. They won't let you drive yourself home. So that can be Uber or someone coming to pick you up, someone that you know. And then lastly, you need to know if you're going to go back to your place, if the vasectomy is in your current city, or if you're going to stay in the uh, city where the vasectomy is taking place. So I actually stayed in Sacramento. Uh, procedure was Tuesday at like noon. I stayed there and I left Friday at noon. So I did stay in Sacramento. And if you want more tips on, if you want all the information you need for your vasectomy, check out the safevasectomy.com. I got everything there. Plus you can do calls.